You know, for someone who's been getting up at the crack of dawn all the last, you are rubbish at keeping quiet. Well, it's only recently I've had to start sneaking about. Oh, what a face. And believe me, it's all part of being the farmer's wife. What you said yesterday... Hey, yeah, can, um... Can we not do this now? It's just, um... I've got a full day with my dad today. It's going to be hard enough to keep it work as it is. Oh. You're taking him to the auction? Yeah. I thought I could do the day away. No talking, then. <sighs> One more thing. I love you. Yeah, well, Marcus said it'll be a quick in and out, so stop your mithering. Marcus said, listen to yourself. When you used to do stuff like this before, you were in control. Taking orders from its sort. All right, calm down. But are you sure you're all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I mean, you're going to be okay with this alibi thing? If I must. Dad, if I don't do this, Moira is going to lose everything. She won't lose you. Hey, but you might lose her if she finds out what you've done. Where are you going to say the money's come from? Do you don't think I've thought it through? Do you don't think I'd be doing this if I hadn't? If you ask me, part of you's looking forward to this. The buzz. I thought you weren't like that anymore. Yeah. Everyone keeps saying that. But I've changed. Well, you have. What have I changed into? Someone who stands back and watches while those closest to him lose everything. But that's OK, because I'm a nice bloke now. The farmer's wife. You will stuff your change. OK, in. Oh. And here he is. Who'd have thought it? Kane Dingle back on the job. It's making me feel all nostalgic. Pity didn't keep the Britpop haircut. Probably take me back to the 90s. Whereas he hasn't changed at all. Still talks too much. You know the lads. I thought this was a two-man job. Don't need got that impression. We never needed anyone before. We never did a job this big before. It looks like I have changed, don't it? So what we're hitting, they need six of us. If you need anything, just give me a shout. We're nearly done. Oh, great. Uh, was that possible future of Butler's Farm? Yeah, with a bit of luck. Oh, I like the present-day Butler's Farm. Most farms, if I get a tea, I'm lucky. Here, I get half a bottle of Rioja. Hmm. Yeah, well, it's not as if I've got much choice. And if they offered another ten grand, I'd bite their hand off. I can't believe it's come to this. <sighs> I could kill that Declan. I don't get enough of that from Keane. How have you stopped him, killing Declan? <sighs> I can't stop Kate from doing anything. Um, things OK between you two? Not really. He sort of proposed. <laughs> and that's how you know things aren't OK? Well, it was a heat of the moment thing. Right, and in the heat of the moment, you said... Kind of avoided answering. And you're surprised things aren't OK between you. No, <laughs> it was the way he came out with it. We were fighting, and, uh, and I said he wasn't my husband, and then he said, what if I was? And, well, I wasn't ready. Sounds like he is, though. So, what about now? Are you ready? You said it was a straightforward crash and run. You said nothing about any drugs. I told you you'd get your hands dirty, and I told you you were replacing someone who wasn't up to it. I thought you would have worked out we weren't mugging grannies. No. We're mugging drug dealers. I thought you loved the idea of ripping off scum like them, playing to the whole new straight living thing. Ripping off scum, I'm fine with. It's tooled-up gangster wannabes I've got a problem. Exactly. Wannabes. They're a bunch of kids. I'm telling you, they ain't got a clue. Yeah, which means they'll be trigger-happy. 
Let's not forget who's in charge here, yeah? And let's not forget who came to me desperate for cash. I can do what I like. Of course you can. And you can be the one to tell them that you're letting them down. What happened to you? What happened to Psycho Kane Dingle? Three, four minutes we'll be out of there. 400 grand between us. <laughs> Give him a love. Moira. <laughs> yeah, now's not a good time. No, 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 it's okay. I'll be quick. I need to say this. You just surprised me yesterday. And the reason I reacted like I did was because of me, of how I am. It's got nothing to do with you. And I know you sometimes think that I'm trying to change you, make you something you're not. But I promise you, I'm in love with you now, who you are now. And I don't want that to ever change. Well, got permission from the wife or what? I'm out. You what? You word. No. No? No. It's too late to pull out now, you're doing it. Even if we have to make you. You've got to be kidding me. You've already sorted a replacement. I'm telling you, it's a nasty piece of work, but Bright will keep his head. Facts about this is him now. Hang on, no, it don't work like that. Right, 20 minutes, and just so as we're clear, after this, i never see you again. Put the phone down. What are you gonna do, shoot me? What makes you think I won't? I don't. Wouldn't be in your best interests. Slow you down, not knowing who might hear that gunshot. But if you want to risk it just to save face in front of this lot, I can't stop you. Or I walk and you do the job with this bloke who, given the time pressures, has agreed to do it for half the amount you were going to pay me. You got it all figured out, haven't you? It's a no. Then you're going to have to shoot me. What happened to you, Kane? My priorities changed. You're throwing away a lot of money. I hope she's worth it. Hey. Hi. How's your day? Busy. You? <laughs> yeah. Nothing else matters, apart from us. You know that. Let's forget about other people. Forget money. No, no. This is your home. I will never do that to you. But what I will promise you is I will always be here. Whether I'm being psycho, Kane Dingle, or a farmer's wife. <laughs> You'll never be a farmer's wife. And I am not going anywhere no matter what you say next. I mean, I, I have changed, cos... I would never have done this before. Maura Barton... Will you... Please, you've got to help me. Where the hell are you? Ask him. This is his fault. Ugh! <sighs> <sighs>